you do a screenshot, you should be able to um, get it all down. Okay, so eat, drink, Nazara, look. Okay. Soon I'll teach you all how to use dictionary. Okay, so then you can check it yourselves. Right, look. Okay, Samia here. Takalama, speak. So all like, basic words that you should know. Right, Dakhala, enter. Faraja, exit. Or to go out. Okay, let me just... Um, Akhaza, take. Okay. And then, so here will be the past. Here will be the present. And this is called the Mazdar. My Mazdar meaning verbal noun. Right, so like, like Akala will mean eight. Yakulu will mean eight. And Akalan, it will be like uh, an eating. Yeah, you, like, 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 you say like, like a like a bite, take a bite of something, take a bite of something, eh? Akalan. Alright, okay, now going to this part. Right, so that's why when Shariba drank, right? Yashrabu, drink. He is drinking. Shurban, a drink or a sip. Right, a sip. Shurban is a sip. Okay, so it's, it's something that becomes a noun. Okay, Hadara, um, attend. To attend a majlis, for example, or be present. I have not done this with you all before, right? I I don't remember doing this with you all. Okay. All right. Um, I'll answer the questions in a while, then, inshallah. Amila to do. Okay. Faala also means to do. Okay. Amila faala. Amila is to do an amalan, an an action. Faala is to do something. Um, Ta'allama study. Allama teach. Alima know. Fahima understand. Like the word faham. Like understand. Like fahaman. To understand. Eh? Understand. Okay. Arafa. Arafa is to know. Okay, to know. Arafa also means to know. Or recognize. It means to recognize as well. Let me go down. Can you all take, you take, take a, a quick uh, screenshot of this? Screenshot. Okay, so once you screenshot, you can you can keep it. I'm going to go down. Because it moves you the thing. Okay, so then I'm going down to here. Okay, let like clear all drawings. Alright. Akhaza. Um, we will for me, right? Take. Right, jalasa sit. Qada also means sit. There are different types of sitting. One sitting that is there's is a slight sitting that like is squat, and then qada means to sit with your with your bum on the ground. Right, qama stand. Zahaba go. Safara travel. Raja'a return. Jaa come. Okay, uh, Fahima understand. Arafa no. Hafiza memorize. Uh, or it also means to protect. To protect or memorize. Saala ask. Or not soal. And soalan to ask. Soal. Ajaba a jawab. Or not jawab. Which is answer. Talaba seek. Seek or to request. Ijtahada, strive. Okay, kasala. Ahabba, love. Okay? Alright, so the words that are, that we're going through. Alright, I want to go to the next, to the next uh, page, inshallah. So if you're okay with this. Alright, so basically, how do you memorize? You memorize all three in one go. So memorize like this. So, so for Afas, what you do is that, when I first learn Arabic, get a Right, and literally, so I would do sit down, Haraja Yakruju Huru Jen, 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 Haraja Yakruju Huru Jen. That's how I would do it. 
I will do a tasbih and I will repeat the word. It's not it's not zikir, but it's basically if you're niat that you want to learn Arabic, right? Because the whole thing about it is that you need to get fluent in the, in the language, right? So you should go to every single word and just do. Um, you can do up to forty times. You want to forty times? You can do a hundred times. You do a hundred times, depending on what you want to memorize. And you can even go like you can even do it in a way whereby you can say the Ar- the English as well. So for example, you can say fake. Akhaza yakhuzu akhazan tek akhaza yakhuzu akhazan tek akhaza yakhuzu akhazan tek akhaza yakhuzu akhazan and to force yourself into memorization right, of the arabic words because language cannot be built if you have no vocabulary right vocabulary can only be acquired in two ways how do we acquire vocabulary one way is by 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 this kind of like raw memorization sit down and memorize right the other way is um by exposure Right, so if you immerse yourself in an Arabic environment, then you can pick it up. But even then, some people who have not learned Arabic formally, if they just immerse themselves in an Arabic environment, they pick up Arabic wrongly. Right, they pick up all the the wrong grammar and the wrong words and they understand things wrongly and so on. Right, so for me personally, I am a f- strong believer in formalized Arabic first, then immersion. Not to go into immersion directly without formalized Arabic. Right, so it's formalized Arabic. Eh? Okay. Um, going down to the next part. Okay, example sentences. Then I'll go into our lessons. Our lesson for today, right? So, so just to go through the meanings of these words. Okay, so akalal waladu khubza. I akalal waladu khubza. Of course, you want to memorize more. You can memorize. Right, walad means boy. Afan do. Right, walad means boy. So especially for those who are beginners here. Every single word probably needs a, probably needs a a a, 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 a translation. Eh, Khubz bread. Okay, Shariba Muhammadun ma ma water. Nazara. Uh, so Shariba was in the in the example just now. So all the numbers they are they are numbered according to the numbers just now, right? Nazara al auladu children. Ila sama sama sky. Okay, samia tu, samia tu. The two here means I, and I'm gonna teach you all this in inshallah in a while. Samia tu, I heard al khabaro anna ka marid. I heard the news. Khabar, right? Surat khabar, eh? Khabar news. I heard the news that anna ka that you marid sick. Okay, I'll just do five because it's a lot, lot to take in. Right, the kalam al tulabu bil lughat al arabiya, al tulabu student. Right, the student spoke in the Arabic language, lugha language. Right, arabiya Arabic. Okay, all right. The rest of the sentences, right, for those of you uh, like who have learned Arabic before. To test yourself on the words here, to understand the meanings of the words. For those of you who are really beginner to Arabic, because as I, as I mentioned, I'm going to teach my class in accordance to the real, real like they have never learned Arabic before in their life. Right, so that beginner, beginner uh, Arabic students, right? So I'm gonna, I'm gonna cater to those people most, uh, most, and first and foremost, uh, and and not to those who have taken Arabic from before, so as to be fair. I right, so because in Major Khalid is the first time we're teaching in Major Khalid. Right, so I will cater my classes to those who have, assuming people have zero Arabic, right? Zero. So that's so why every single word I'm translating out, right, for you all. Okay, so I'm gonna give five only, right? Five only for the sentences. Maybe every week we can take a few, a few more, right, for us to just uh, memorize more. Here you see the words I'm giving you, I'm giving you here are nouns like boy, bread, water, sky, children, news, sick, student. Arabic language, so all nouns, eh? Inshallah, nouns. Okay, Alhamdulillah. Okay, let me um do a new share and open up a whiteboard. Okay, last sorry, last um lesson, right? I taught you all on. I taught you all on past tense, correct? Eh, there go past tense. Yeah, I did. I did past tense, correct? I taught you all on the past tense, and I taught you all on the past tense of third person, correct? Third person past tense. 
and I and I said today I want to go into second persons and first persons. All right. So going back to our uh word. So if I go to my PDF, let me see on my PDF first. Um. Okay, the first one on the PDF. Eh, let me go to the PDF first. The first one on the PDF. Go backwards. Is akala. Okay, le. Oh, okay, okay. Akala. All right. Okay, I don't. I don't use uh, uh, akala. It may be. Is word shariba. Okay, shariba, shariba. Okay, so now the word shariba. Let's recap our uh, third person past tense first. All right, remember. Going into the whiteboard. Okay, third person past tense. So I have the word shariba. My original word is shariba. Shariba. And as mentioned in its original form, it already has the word he inside. Right? In its original form, it already has the word he inside. So I'm going to take Shariba and I'm going to do my revision. I'm going to do on uh, third persons. Who are my third persons? My third persons are he, she, they, two. Right? Um, they two males, they two females. Okay, let's undo this. All right, two males, two females. Then the they all right, males and females mix up. Then they woman. Right. So remember last week we mentioned right he, she. I don't do anything. I don't have any changes whatsoever in the he. Shariba. She, however, I will change it and I will add in something extra. Correct? Remember? Right? I will add in a ta. I add in a ta at the end and we put, put it as orange. Shari. But a ta with a sukun. Okay? They, tu. Oh, I didn't put it in Arabic. So he is hua. She is hia. He, yeah, huwa. Right, they will be huma. Huma. Okay, they to female also is huma. Okay, they all, you say, hum. And they woman, you will say, hunna. Hum. Huma. Okay. For day two males, you just take the, let me use the yellow, you take the original word and you add in an alif. Remember, to, to show dual, say an original word, sha, ri, ba, and you put in the alif, let me show the, 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 the changes here, in red. Okay, this alif is called the alif of duality. Remember last year I mentioned Alif of duality. Alif that shows dual. There's two of them there. Okay, for the female, right, two of them, I take from the she. I don't take from the she, I take from the she, I go down. Right, so what do I have? I have Shari Bats, right? But because I have two women, Shari Bats, I have two women, I have to put an Alif into the Ta. So I have a Ta here. And I must put an alif to show there's two of them. Okay? So it becomes sha ri ba ta. Hey, sha ri ba. Okay. Okay, now the last one, they all. So again, I go back to my original word, they all. Sha ri. Uh, so sha ri what? Sha ri. Let me show the jama'ah, the wow of jama'ah, wow of many. Sharibu. Right, so you have Sharibu. Sharibu. The last one for the woman. Sharib. Sharibna. Let me use um, blue. Okay, to show the, the noon of femininity. Sharibna. Okay, now we're doing our second persons. This was done last week, eh? So, second persons. I'm going to follow suit. Right, so second persons. 
What who are they? They are the yous. Uh, you, 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 you. So you following the pattern, eh? You one meal. Uh, you boy, uh, you oh, Ahmed. Then you one female. Oh Fatima, you Fatima. Alright. Then you two. Uh, two of you. Uh, two of you. Let's undo it. See me escape. Right, two of you. Here, two of you also. So here was two of you, Ahma and Ali. Here, two of you, Fatima and Aisha. Okay. Here, you all. You all, many. Many yous. You know, like in, in, in Liverpool, when I met Liverpoolians in Tarim, they have they have a plural for you, just yous. All of yous. All of yous come here. <laughs> all of yous. I just not not in English, but they have it like the, the, the those from Liverpool. They say use use all use all I use. <laughs> okay. Um. And then many women. Uh, but you all are you all. So one man. Let me just uh use the the colors. Okay. So for one person, let me use black. Mm, for one person, I have an. How do I say you in Arabic? I say an. I use a color. Sorry, I use purple color lah. Okay, anta. Okay, anta. Okay, all the U's begin with an. 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 But I differ in what you say. So you, Ahmad. You, Ahmad. Anta, anta, right? You Fatima, you Fatima, anti, anti, you Ahmad and Ali, Ahmad Ali, the two of you, two of you come here, right? Two of you, so you say antuma, antuma, right? Anti, anta, antuma, two Fat, you two Fatima Aisha, you two. Same thing also. Antuma. Antuma. All of you over there. Come here. All of you. Antum. Okay. Antum. All of you. Antum. And all of you women. Sit down, no woman. Antuna. Okay. Antun. Antuna. Okay. Anta, anti, antuma, antuma, antum, antuna. Okay, now comes, I need to put all this into the verbs. Just think about Arabic. Everything is all put into the verb. So you can just have say the word, one word, and it already has a full sentence. No, inshallah. So if I say, you drank. Like, Ahmad, you drank Ahmad. Ahmad, you drank. So what do I say? Ahmad, anta. Sharib Anta Sharib Ta okay. Anta Sharib Ta Ya Ahmad You drank O Ahmad If I say You drank O Fatima You say Anti Sharib Anti Sharib Ti Anti Sharib ti ya Fatima. You drank o Fatima. Now Antuma, they're the same. So you notice the beginning is all the same. It's all Sharib, Sharib. If a sukun, eh? Sharib, Sharib, and Sharib. Okay. So the purple. Antuma Sharib Tuma. Just repeat the purple part. Antuma Sharib Tuma. There's no difference between male and female for the, the for the twos. Antum Sharib Tum. See it, it follows eh, in the pattern. Antuna Sharib Tuna. Okay, Sharib Tuna. I think I put the dot at the bottom wrong. Okay. 
Okay, sharib. Tuna. Okay, see that second person. So that's how we say the two of you drank, the all of you drank, some of you drank, and so on. Okay, let me just finish the first person. So this last one, and you can memorize this for the for the for the week. All right. Now we're going to the first person. Okay. The first person are only two people, which is I and we. Okay, in Arabic I say Anna for I. In Arabic I say Nahnu. Nahnu for we. Alright? And very simply, how do I change my past tense? Sha Rib. Sha Rib. Okay. So what do I do? This is red. Sharib for Anna. Sharib. Tu for Nahnu. Sharib. Na. Sharib na. Sharib tu. Okay. Alright. If you all are okay with this, I want to give you some uh, tests to do now. Right. Some tests to do now. Okay, I'm gonna type out the I'm gonna type out the the, the, the English um sentence, and I want you to look at the set at the words you have in your list in the PDF. Let me share the PDF first. Okay, I hope you all have this. You can just can screenshot it very quickly, all right? So now I'm gonna open up the PDF. Okay, all right. So what I want you all to do now with the PDF is that. Oh, where's my annotation? Okay. With the PDF, um, this let's try one word first, okay? The word, uh, Nalzoro. Okay, Nalzoro. Okay, do a full list. Right, do on one side. Like, Nalzoro means look, right? So write for me on your piece of paper, right on your on your or your or your notebook. He looked. She looked. And uh, they too looked. Okay, they two males. They two females looked. Right, they all looked. And then the woman looked. Okay. Do this now. Write down all the Arabic equivalents. If any questions, you can just um, raise your hand eh, and I will just admit you all. Okay, any questions, just tell me.
Okay, are you all are you all okay? You all done? Alright, so the book was Nazara, right? So I'm gonna change I'm gonna I'm just gonna change it from here. Right, so I'm gonna remove all my shariba. Right, so all the shariba I remove. So we'll follow exactly the same pattern, eh? Okay. Right? So all the additional additional words, letters will, will, will sit the same way. So for he is the same, Shariba, eh, sorry, uh, Nazara. Hua Nazara. Nazara. Right? He looked. Hua Nazara. She looked, we will say, Nazarat. Nazarat. Right? They looked. Na zoro. Na zoro. From Alif at the end. The two of them looked, the females. Na zoro ta. Remember? There's a ta there. Okay. Na zoro ta. And then they all na zoro. Na zoru. Right. The all woman Nazorna. Nazorna. Okay. Nazorna. Right. The woman Nazorna. Alright. Okay. I hope you all had gotten that. I had gotten that correctly, inshallah. Okay. So, um, okay, Alhamdulillah. <laughs> okay, so what you can do is in your own, your own time, if you, if you, especially if you're new to all of this, you can practice at your own time all the words here. You can practice. How do I say, like, like, uh, you, you or Fatima, um, let's say I use the word, uh, heard, right? Samia is heard, eh? I say, you, Fatima, heard. So I will say, Samia'ti. Was anti samiati, right? If I say you or Fatima, uh, or I say you or Ali, um, uh, exited. So I say kharajta, kharajta ya Ali, kharajta. Okay, and, and so on lah. Right, so you can practice. You can practice. Uh, this this entire page. Okay, let me just do a bit more of the grammar here because for a bit more time. I'll just go through some more of the words here lah. Just, just, just to take the just to expose. So I'm not expecting those who are especially those who are beginner Arabic students to memorize all these words on this page. I expect you all to memorize all the words on this page, on page two. I read page three, I don't expect you all to memorize on page three, but for those who are more uh, who have learned Arabic from before and it's easy to memorize page two, then then you have to you have to put in effort to memorize page three. Okay. Yeah, from from number six onwards, eh? Okay, for number six. Okay, dahala means to enter. Al ustazu al fasla. I said ustaz is understood. Is understood what ustaz what ustaz means, right? Get the get the annotation out. I don't know why my computer seems to be lagging a lot. <laughs> okay, um, so ustaz is ustaz fasla class. Okay, so the Ustaz entered the class. خرج المسلمون من المسجد. Understood, right? The Muslims, Muslimun, the Muslims, خرج, they exited, they went out of the masjid. من المسجد, from the mosque. Okay, min here means from. Okay. أخذ الطفل الكرة. أخذ الطفل, طفل child. Child. Kura ball. So the child took the ball. Okay, the child took the ball. Jalas al khatibu an al member. Jalas sit khatib, uh, the one who gives a uh, khutbah. Khatib is the one who gives khutbah. Okay, right, alal mimbar. Uh, mimbar, you know, right? There is a pedestal, a mimbar. 
Sallal maridu qa'idan Sallal pray Al marid The one who is sick Qa'idan Sitting down He prayed sitting down Al qiyamu fi salati Li sahihi wajib Al qiyam That means to stand Fi salah In the prayer Ala li sahih Li sahih is for the healthy one And for the healthy person, standing up to pray is wajib. It's not sunnah, it's wajib. Okay. Right. Uridu zahab ila surabaya. Okay. Uridu zahab. Zahab means to go. Go. I, I want to. Uridu is I want to. I want to go to surabaya. Right. Surabaya, surabaya. In, in Indonesia. Firu Gadan Ila Jakarta. Uh, Jakarta, Jakarta as well. It's an Indonesian book. Nusa Usafir, travel. I will travel tomorrow. Okay, I will travel tomorrow to Jakarta. Raja Atta Jiru Minasuk. Raja A came back. Okay, Minasuk. Alright, Alhamdulillah. Uh, we'll stop there for today, inshallah. Not go on from there. Inshallah. So, if there are any questions, you can just um, 